What you doing, bud? Okay. I want you to demonstrate your uh, science fair for us. No. <laughs> Come on. No! He's not going to do I'll it. I'll upload it on YouTube. No. Yeah, you asked for us to take a video of this. Whatever. Okay. What's your paper about? What's your science fair project about? Uh, pH papers and how they compare. Oh, really? Okay, what kind of pH papers? Um, homemade and store bought. So, did you make your own homemade? You made your own paper, pH papers? Mm, I had help. You had help? <laughs> okay, show us a little bit about it. Okay. My question. Can I make the pH paper? Be used as an accurate replacement to store about pH papers. If I use homemade pH strips in the store bought pH strips, then test them on the same acids and bases. The homemade pH strips will probably be the most accurate because they are made of natural substances. And that's your research paper, material, independent variable. I put the dependent. Okay, the dependent variable. All right, explain that. Um, in the experiment, I am using measuring the pH levels. The difference will be seen in how independent variables react to the pH levels or dependent variables. I see. Why is my why is what? Hey. Okay. Your results here. So what did you find? Um was your highest hypothesis right? Um I found that homemade pH strips are were very effective in finding out if a substance <laughs> is was acidic, neutral, or alkaline. However, you need <laughs> to test <laughs> specific uh, amount of acid or al alkalinity a substance has. It, it is my opinion that it would be best for you to use stored by pH papers it, with the color chart to use as a guide. I see. All right. And I'm not going to say all that dumb baby love that. Yeah, yeah. I see. This is your guy, your book, huh? Mm -hmm. Data. No guestbook and comments, huh? Yes. Okay, so you won a blue. Now, how many people got that? And what's that about? Um, it is about. It's about how how good I did. Okay, so these are the fifth grade top ten winners. Okay, so Donovan of the top ten yours is number four. All your fifth grade class. High five on that. Woohoo! Alright. Peace out. Peace out.